question number 27 if alpha is equal to 0.98 and IC naught reverse saturation current is 6 microamperes and IR is 100 microamperes it's not IR so question is incorrect it is IB means base current if base current if it is 100 microamperes for a transistor then what is the value of IC as soon as you get this correction you can easily solve this question this simple formula based question very easy question everybody can answer this question if you know the formula fine if you don't know don't worry just see the my formula and extension I'll give a few more formulas which will be helpful to solve this question and everybody will solve by knowing this formulas okay don't feel like you cannot solve this question fine now two formulas you need to know in order to solve this question one is relation between alpha and beta and what is IC formula first formula 1 by alpha minus 1 by beta is equal to 1 this is the first formula relationship between alpha and beta of the transistor or some people will remember beta is nothing but alpha by 1 minus alpha both are correct it is derived from this fine if you can remember this first formula and second formula is nothing but IC is nothing but beta IB plus 1 plus beta into IC naught fine so just from the first formula I substituted alpha alpha is given as 0 0.98 right I substituted 0 0.98 and beta I don't know I'm finding beta just I simplified you can check okay 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 so just simplification you can go through this finally you'll get beta as 49 so you got beta after getting beta just substitute in IC expression beta you know IC naught is known IB is given it's not IR IB is given just substitution beta is 49 IB 1 plus beta 1 plus 49 IC naught so 49 IB plus 50 IC naught IB is given in the question as you can see IB is given 100 microamperes and IC naught is 6 microamperes so 100 microamperes 6 microamperes just I'm multiplying 49 into 100 4900 15 into 6 300 so 49 plus 3 5200 microamperes you can convert into milliamps 5.2 milliamps so the right choice is very simple question if you don't confuse if you assume this as ib the question is very very simple so the right choice is option d 5.2 milliamps so this is the right choice fine now let us see the extension and formulas which are possible there is a scope of asking from the similar concepts the similar kind of concepts or formulas let us see them and also Calculating this beta will take nearly one minute for you. So, but in XRO exam, there are 90 questions and each question you 90 minutes duration is there. So each question will give you hardly, you need to do hardly in one minute. So what I am suggesting is, if you, if he is given alpha, you should be able to tell beta within no second. Okay, means within one second, you should be able to tell. Okay, let us see that extension one. Beta is equal to alpha by one minus alpha. This is very simple formula you can tell. If you do, if you, I am trying to remember this. If 0 0.49, 0 0.49 by 1 minus 0.49 means 0 0.49 by 0 0.51, something like that you need to remember. So instead of that, directly you can remember. If it is 98, 0.98, remember it as half of it, 49. If it is 0 0.99, 99 means same, 99 will occur. Just try to remember these two. Many times they'll ask in the exam, these two values only they'll use. Okay, 0 0.98, half of it, 0 0.99, 99. If it is 1, it's simple, infinity, everybody will tell. These are the ideal cases, right? Alpha is 1 and beta is infinity. So these three things you remember, okay? Relation between alpha and beta is this. Beta is nothing but alpha by 1 minus alpha. Relation between gamma and beta. Gamma is nothing but 1 plus beta. Please remember these two relations. Even this relation may ask in, in this year is so exam. So beta is alpha by 1 minus alpha and gamma is 1 plus beta. Now let us see the third one these are the first formulas just like beta alpha alpha beta alpha gamma all these relations okay now I think you can find a relationship between alpha and gamma just do it is an exercise it's simple just combine one and two uh, extensions okay after that this is done you need to know the expressions for IC IC or output express output current expressions okay fine now generally the BJT is configured in three ways it can be configured in common base common emitter common collector now what happens if it is conferred in these three different regions if nothing is given if nothing they have not specified in this question they have not specified is common emitter or common collector or common base simply assume that it is common emitter if nothing is specified 
assume it as because common emitter will give the correct amplification we will use this in a practical scenario if nothing is given assume it as common emitter fine in common emitter the input transistor has three terminals you know base emitter and collector if it is common emitter common means you have grounded this emitter if common is common is emitter then input will be base output will be collector so output is collected at collector so output current he'll ask ic is nothing but beta ib plus one plus beta into ic naught that's we have seen in the previous question this is generally asked and it is asked 90 percent of the times these are less chances common base and common collector if he is asking he'll specify that in the question it is common base or common collector if nothing is specified assume that it is common emitter fine now common base in common base the base is common input will be emitter output will be collector so in the first two cases output will be collector okay collector so ic is the current in this the current expression is minus alpha i plus ic naught please try to memorize in common collector the input is base output is emitter the expression for current output current ie because emitter is the output right output current ie is nothing but just like beta ib plus 1 plus beta into ic naught this is like gamma ib plus gamma ic naught try to memorize these expressions these are very very important and try to note down in your notes you can get a question based on this once again i am repeating ic in uh, sorry one ic in common base is nothing but minus alpha ie plus ic naught and in common empty it's easy ic is nothing but beta ib plus 1 plus beta into ic naught and finally in common collector ie is the current output current ie is nothing but gamma ib plus gamma ic naught fine similar to this ic i mean similar to this you can compare it is almost similar okay gamma ib plus gamma ic naught fine so in this way you can find any question so try to memorize this my extensions they are very very useful in your isro exam because is in isro exam especially questions from previous years are directly appearing without changing options also and also if he is asking questions he is asking questions based on those previous year questions some extensions that's why i'm giving so many extensions because from these extensions only you're going to get many questions at least 10 to 30 percent of the questions it will cover so try to memorize if you like the video if you can like or you can subscribe the video for getting more updates thank you